How to add Noboard to Streamlabs OBS Adding Noboard to Streamlabs OBS enables you to display your keystrokes or controller inputs, allowing viewers to see your in-game actions and enhancing your content's interactivity. So I have here my Noboard in my Streamlabs. As you can see, if I click, for example, the queue, you will see it moving. And then if I am going to type like this, you will also going to see it uh, basically press the key. And yeah, I'm going to show you how to add this one. First things first, I'm just going to delete this and show you exactly the entire process so here's how we are going to do it i want you to go ahead and search for no board github and then you're going to want to click this one here this is going to be the first thing that is going to pop and then scroll down until you see this under assets no board dash rewrite version 1.3 i'm going to download this one all right and then after downloading it i'm going to head onto my downloads folder which is this one here and i'm just going to try to put this in a new folder i'm going to call it no board right and i'm going to put this inside in order for it to be organized so after opening it you're just going to want to extract the files here all right there you go so here are the files and then this one in particular i want you to open this one all right now you should see something like this it's kind of like a plain blue screen what you're going to do is right click it and you should be able to see an option here that says load keyboard i want you to tap on that and click the category and you will be seeing here different options i'm going to show them to you one by one all right so here's how it looks so we have here the burning fish and if i'm going to basically go down you should see all the other options available so i want you to choose the one that applies to you the most say for example this one if you're going to be gaming and then you have here the keyboard style there are keyboard style differences here the one that i like the best is that this one here so the white one i'm going to click this one and basically that's how it looks now we're going to add this to our streamlabs to do that what you're going to do is you're going to add a source and then we're going to choose window capture click add source once again and i'm going to call this one no board and click add source now under the window you're going to search for no board which is this one here and then you're going to click done now you're going to resize this one and basically put this anywhere you want but for the sake of this tutorial i want this to be a bit bigger all right just like that now as you can see here there is a green screen and we want that removed so to do that what you're going to do is right click on it you should see here filters um, add filter and we're going to be choosing the chroma key right this one here click add and boom you can see that it's now clear so close this one and i'm going to try to show you if i'm going to open this one you can see that the background is actually transparent so you can see the background as it moves so yes congratulations everybody that is how you're going to add no board to streamlabs obs and by the way, I would highly suggest to upgrade to Streamlabs Ultra to level up your streaming quality and experience. You can save up the $10 of discount right away after clicking on the link in the description box and the comment section below. And as always, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like if this helps you out.